really I if I, this is what I have so far but I'll update this one and so it goes like if you are in a dark tomb like you have no hope look above you right here and na right now you will rise again so come out of come out out of your darkness and face the light because the light is God and God is light. You people, you believe that you are living in a tomb environment. But when really you're not. You're just suffocating yourself inside this mindset that you think you might be able to pass on to another dimension, to another realm of what might seem to the world what compromise the Bible, the truth, the word. I like to say this now before I jump into any things. If this seems to offend anyone, anyone at all, asked you if you want to right now you can go off to another video you, you can sit here and listen or just comment and do whatever you want but I will, I will say this now I'm going to say this now if you feel like you're in a tomb like environment, please do not believe that. Because you might not even notice you're in that kind of situation until the last minute. But when truly you need to see the outlines of what happened before it happened, connect the dots. I know that everyone knows I can connect the dots. You have one you find a point and you find another, then connect. So I know people know how to connect the dots. Find that which that gift that's just already been given. But you need to see past the what comes after the ridiculing patterns that this world seems to be saying it's right to ridicule a certain belief, ridiculing some sort of outcome, ridiculing some things that people don't really comprehend until they comprehend what's been said after the effect of the not comprehending it at the right time. People need to wake up. We need to wake up. We need to wake up out of our tombs. No matter who you are, what your age is, we need to. I'm already seeing people my age dying. Some but by different things. I am looking at this as a time to say, wake up. If you feel like you have no hope, turn to Jesus, please. At least that's my opinion.